Welcome to the Heavy Spoilers Show, I'm your host Definition and this is the channel where we explain it so you don't have to. Game of Thrones Season 8 Episode 5 has a hell of a lot to unpack from it and the penultimate battle has one huge symbol at the end of it that's causing some confusion and speculation across the internet. Throughout this video I'll be breaking down the true meaning of the white horse seen in the closing scene of the show and discussing how it ties into the overall lore of Game of Thrones. This is full spoilers ahead, so if you haven't seen the episode yet and don't want anything ruined, then I highly recommend that you turn off now. With that out the way, I just want to give a huge thank you for clicking this video. I hope you enjoy it. Now sit back, relax, and let's get into the true meaning of the white horse. Okay, so the first thing to take from the horse is that it initially belonged to Golden Company leader Harry Strickland, who could be seen riding it just before the Battle of King's Landing. We're not exactly sure of how it managed to make it through the fight, but its appearance at the end is symbolic on a number of levels. The first thing that we can assume is that it was sent by Bran to rescue Arya out of the area and the destruction around her. Bran is this universe's Doctor Strange, able to see all of the outcomes and you can bet that this horse showing up is no accident and that he has sent it to escort Arya for a reason. Ned Stark himself owned a white horse and this arrival can be seen as a helping hand from her family that will help to rescue the character out of the rubble. Earlier in the episode, a girl that Arya attempted to save can too be seen holding a white horse and Bran has no doubt purposely chosen this creature in order to remind Arya that Daenerys has went off the rails and caused the death of many innocent lives. Reddit user Namika said the following, which to me means a lot. I think the horse at the end has a much more obvious meaning. And over half a dozen scenes in this episode, we are shown a young peasant girl, and every time we see her, she's clutching what seems to be her only possession, a small white horse figurine with stained legs. In quite a few of the shots with her, the horse is literally in the center of the shot, and it's the only white thing, so it really stands out. Even when she's struggling to carry her mother, she's clutching her little horse. Then, after her death, the camera literally stops and holds this shot for a good three seconds. And what do we pan to right after? A living embodiment of the girl's beloved white horse with stained legs. The horse then just stands there in the middle of the fire and smoke and gives itself over to Arya. The horse is clearly tied thematically to the girl that Arya failed to save. Perhaps it represents her spirit, or simply a reminder of the innocent girl that was killed whom Arya plans to avenge. I think this holds a lot of weight, and though she could not save her, Arya is riding forth on something similar to what the girl cared about the most in order to take Daenerys down. Symbolically, the horse to me shows the downfall of Daenerys and how she has changed over the seasons. In season one, the character was presented a pristine white horse by Khal Drago, whereas this white horse is war-torn and emits the destruction of Danny's deeds, and it cements just how far she has come. In addition to this, a lot of fans have pointed out that in the Bible, chapter Revelations, there is a verse that states, I looked and there before me was a pale horse, its rider was named Death. This could mean that Arya is death personified and that she is riding to bring an end to Daenerys, who I'm sure many fans will agree needs to be stopped. For me, it's probably the best part of season eight so far, and I can't believe how much subtext can be taken from this one interaction. Obviously, I'd love to hear your thoughts on the white horse and if you took anything else from it. Is this a reach? Is this the best foreshadowing ever? Comment below and let me know and if you enjoyed this video then please like it and make sure you check out my breakdown of all the leaked spoilers for the finale next week which will be linked at the end. We've also just launched a merchandise section for the channel so if you want to support the videos and get something out of it make sure you click one of the links in the boxes below. This is a channel for people who are never missing television so if that's the kind of thing you like you need to subscribe to Definition. Thanks again for taking the time to watch this. You've been the best and I'll see you next time. Take care. Peace.